This is Matt Matros, once again, Stocks Poker Tournament Pro, here with my second video from the World Championship of Online Poker main event, $2,600 buy-in, no limit hold'em event. Uh, I have about my starting stack, and just to give you a quick update what's happening in this hand, there were two limpers for 200 and then HG1689 made it 800 which is a pretty small raise behind uh, two limpers. So I chose to call on the button with Queen-9 suited with the deep stacks. So I take a pot in position against these three guys. And you see I flop a flush draw on a paired board, two kings and a deuce out there. And HG, the original raiser, is deciding what to do. And you can see there's about 3,500 or exactly 3,500 in the pot. And he bets 1,400, which is a very small bet into a $3,500 pot. I shouldn't say very small, but it's a pretty small bet. Uh, board double pairs on the turn, which uh, is not the greatest thing in the world. It could be drawing dead, but it's not a disaster either, especially when he checks. This this is a spot where I could have decided to try to take it down right then and there uh, with a bet, but in my experience, double paired boards are not great bluffing boards. People tend to pay you off at least once. Uh, when I hit this queen on the end, I actually like my hand now. Actually, I think I have the best hand. I really don't think HG checked it twice to me. Uh, with a better hand than this. So I'm betting 3,800, hoping he calls me with ace high, or hoping he calls me with two tens or two jacks or two nines, something like that, hoping that I'm betting ace high. Uh, so I will make thin value bets in position if I think I have the best hand. Uh, I do not really expect to get a check raise here. It would be a strange way for him to play kings full. Certainly not impossible, but uh, I was willing to take the chance that he did not have a big hand, and then he might call me with something. If it turned out he didn't, that's fine. Uh, I, of course, had the best hand. There's no way he folded a better hand than that. At least I would hope not. So here Don Jr. opens for three times the big blind. And Dracula, I don't know if you, how many of you who watched this video or watching this video watched my first video. But Dracula plays a lot of hands, and he plays them strangely, and he's he's been a guy who's been involved. So he's someone that we are looking to get involved with. And it turns out this time looks like he was just disconnected or something. He just timed out. But uh, the big blind defense, Don Jr. makes a continuation bet on the flop and takes it down. So those of you who have watched earlier videos of mine know that I don't love offsuit hands, uh, even the connected.